The only way to effectively reduce irregular migration is to give people some hope of regular migration. Give them the opportunity to migrate pursuant to law through regular legal pathways. This is a win-win situation. The United States can create more work visas for people to work in areas of the U.S. labor market where there currently are shortages, for example, in the agriculture sector or in the elder care sector. By and large, these are jobs that Americans are not signing up to do, and labor is needed in these areas. So permit migrants from elsewhere to come to the United States and work in these fields and create specific visa categories for them to work in these fields where currently the U.S. labor market is not sufficient to meet the demand. This means more people will be entering through regular migration than through irregular migration. Regular migration avoids the problem of bolstering organized crime. Regular migration creates greater transparency. It allows for proper security assessments. I mean, the president's speech was largely focused on potential security threats. Well, create regu regular pathways for entering the United States, and then the U.S. government agencies can do full security vetting of each individual seeking to enter the United States. This ultimately is the only way to effectively reduce irregular migration, and it's a win-win situation.